Hi everyone and welcome or welcome back. In today's video, we'll be taking my best friend from that to this. Baby, let's get into it. <laughs> this video is sponsored by Ali Annabelle. In today's video, we will be featuring the 180% density deep wave 22 inch wig. I'm just doing a quick unboxing to show you all what came in the package. It came in that nice silk large bag with some literature as well as some wig caps and now we're gonna unbox the wig itself once again it is 22 inch 180% density and the texture is deep wave and here's how it looks straight out of the package and now for the inside construction of the wig it is machine wefted and it comes with about six combs as well as the adjustable band inside and it is a 4x4 closure wig now we're going to bleach the knots using a 40 volume developer. For bleaching powder, I'll be using L'Oreal Quick Blue. I like using the blue powder just because it combats any orange tones that may be present after bleaching knots. Now getting into the shampoo because you cannot have a mommy makeover day without the full experience with the shampoo, with the steamer, the conditioning, all the works. And after we towel her up, you're going to see our other best friend coming for the full surprise. Let's go. Not taking care of his kids. Hello. Like what? That's Baby, weird. what you want to do? <laughs> 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 Ooh, <my God. laughs> Y'all stuck together. Hold on. What's happening? I don't know. Oh, no. Hold on. <laughs> Wait. What would you do? Look at my face. <laughs> Well, friends, the surprise was a success. Now we're going back to the mommy makeover video. If you're blessed enough to have solid and real best friends, you know that every now and then, either you or your friend may be going through some things that life just happens to throw your way. And sometimes you just need TLC and time with your best friends to get cute, feel good, and all that good stuff. So that's exactly what we surprised our best friend with for this video. Now I'm just drying the wig. The knots are nice and bleached, and I rinse them off with some purple shampoo. And while that's drying, I'm gonna blow dry her hair to get it ready for the foundation. And once we have it completely blown dry, we are going to get into the braid down. Voila, nothing too crazy because it's textured hair, we didn't have to do small braids, but I am gonna sew them together so that they can be nice and taut and as flat as possible, even with her hair being dense and me not doing a small braid down. There's no such thing as a wig application or any type of braid down without oil. So we also had to put that in. And next I'm gonna go in with the got to be and just slick her edges back so they are out of the way for this clueless install. And I'm also gonna go in with the blow dryer just to make sure that the got to be holds her edges in place. And once again, they are not touched by the glueless adhesive. Even though we're not using glue, we don't want hair anyway. And then I'm gonna wipe it off using alcohol before going in with my pair of stockings and sewing it down to get into the ball cap application. Once I get the stocking on, I'm gonna cut holes into her ears. If you know ball cap application, you've seen this before, but you may have not seen this method of measuring how far your lace goes across your forehead and sewing that perimeter so that you know exactly how much ball cap you need under your lace. You'll see throughout this video that the vibes were on point. We hadn't seen each other in a minute. Our best friend lives two hours away. And so it was just nice to have this time to be together and vibe out while we got her all the way together. I'm using wig grip gel to solidify that ball cap and we're gonna put her under the dryer while that dries for about 10 minutes. Once that's good and in there, we're gonna cut off the excess cap and then we're gonna try on the wig, making sure that it fits properly <laughs> without pulling her hair out if you're doing this at home. And then for the parts of the cap that did not melt or got cut off whenever I was cutting the excess cap, I just applied more wig grip gel and held that down with my rat tail comb before applying the concealer. If you don't already know this, alcohol is your best friend while doing a wig install because before applying any makeup, before applying any gel, you have to make sure that the skin is clear. And so we're just getting the ball cap to match her skin. And then we're gonna wipe away any excess product and put more concealer that matches her skin tone under the wig. For glueless adhesive, I'm using the Frontal Queen's Lace Adhesive Spray and I'm just clipping back the hair aside from the baby hair so that I can 
keep them exactly where they need to be for later and you're going to see me cut off the extra lace off of the sides before applying the glue lace adhesive on my stick blow drying it and laying that lace down and i only did two layers because she wasn't gonna wear this long and she wanted the option of being able to take it off and on at home now i'm gonna tie that down with an elastic band and let that blow dry before cutting it off and it did sit for about 10 minutes in between now i'm gonna clip those baby hairs back and cut off the lace in a zigzag pattern this lace was a little on the thicker side, I won't lie to you, but I'm just going to go through and blend the baby hairs. And you see I curled them because it just flows better that way. And for laying the baby hairs, I first go in with Love Letter. <laughs> it's too much. I can't even think straight the way this girl's cutting up. Sorry, I went in with Love Letter Edge Lay and then with the wig grip gel before tying that down while I did finishing touches. Or really while our other best friend came in and got into it with the makeup tip. So, like I said, we were keen in this entire video because we really all needed this time. K the MUA is getting into it on the makeup tip now using the Jaclyn Hill palette. And I don't really know all the details of what else she did, but all of her makeup information and her business info will be listed in the description box. And now we both came in with the finishing touches at the same time before getting into defining these curls. Now the texture of this hair was everything. It was super soft and I really loved how defined the waves were into the hair. So the lace wasn't my favorite, but the wig itself is a really nice wig and it's also affordable. Of course, that will be linked in the description box as well. Right back into yeah, vlogging so mode. So oh, let me pause so this. Girl. Only we oh, would be at the girl. shop till 11 o'clock at night doing mm. mommy makeovers. But look at the girl. Good night. I'm a real girl. I just, I'm a real. Yes. A whole one. I mean, I knew I had kids. We did that. A girl. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. After this, we are going to $2 Tuesday. $2 Tuesday, if you know, you know. It's the strip club's favorite night of the week. Her. Right next to Wife Her Wednesdays. You heard about Wife Her Wednesdays? <laughs> that's amateur night. They be going up. This but yeah, that's where we're going tonight. And um, I think this is the end of this vlog. And we gonna see y'all when we see y'all. Better friends. What? What is it? Threat, set, 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 set. <laughs> As you can see, this video ended up being a hybrid of a vlog and a hair tutorial all in one with all the vibes, all the hair tees. Like, look at these waves. Look at this pattern. It's giving vacation. It's giving summertime. It's giving everything it needs to give. Like, even look at the change in her energy from the beginning to the end of the video. I just love it. I'm so glad we were able to do this and pull this off. Huge shout out and thank you to Ali Annabelle for sponsoring this video. Once again, all the wig details will be in the description box below. Yeah. Get into what the lace, you know what I'm saying? It's Get into giving. the face, you know what I'm saying? It's giving. Get into what it's gonna give, because it's gonna give you everything that you need to do. So I might even give you a little razzle dazzle on the end, you know what I'm saying? But my best friends are the shit. Okay, go ahead. You know what I'm saying? And they smile, you know what I'm saying? And if you really knew, then you know I'm a little ass boy. You know what I'm saying? But that made me a grown ass woman. <laughs> Boy, I can't channel her because I got on my tennis shoes. You know what I'm saying? Oh so it's still, God. I'm deeply rooted in the trenches. You know what I'm saying? Oh. You can't edit this out, right? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so make sure that you book with PS by Brie. You can find her on Instagram at Brianna Sahari. You can also find her at PS by Brie. You can also shop with the girl at the Love Letter Collection. Everything used was by the Love Letter Collection. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, Walmart could never. Christmas Nature could never. <laughs> you know what I'm 